hasala e, nimewahi kuipata kwenye mihogo yetu ya kienyeji hasala mihogo yote ilioza e, ilioza kwa sababu ilikuwa na michirizi michirizi yote ilikuwa na uozo uozo tu mihogo kwa hiyo nilikuwa na hasala kubwa sikuvuna sikupata chochote yani tatizo hili limeanza kwa miaka kwenye miaka ya tisini na kitu ndio maana hata kilimo cha mihogo wengi wakakimbia hilo hii wanaita ni, ni, ni kutoka kutoka gangweli wanaita gangweli haya eh sengerema hii ni, ni ugonjwa tayari hapa mihogo hii ina ugonjwa tayari imeathirika hata mhogo wake ukitaka kuutoa umeoza ugonjwa the, this is the typical symptoms of the cassava mosaic disease. If the plants are affected by this disease, then there is no yield or you get very little. If the infected, infection is from early stages, then you don't, you don't get anything. The planting material, the cutting which was used, it was also infected. So the selection of the materials was not good. Yeah. because the friction was from the start. So when the farmers do not understand the, 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 the disease well, and they go to other farm, neighboring fields picking the materials, <coughs> they take even the infected ones because of not knowing, because of lack of knowledge. So they just pick without knowing it's a disease, they go and they plant, and the disease continues spreading. There are no methods of control that can cure an infected cassava plantation. The only way to eradicate the viruses is to ensure that farmers have access to virus-free cassava planting material of disease-resistant or immune varieties.